All right, so here we are with um, our PDF open. This is, this PDF here contains all the activity exercises for this module. Uh, there are <coughs> uh, basically two, two or three in this. This one I'm not quite sure, but uh, the order which they're they're asking us to uh, follow is to open up the, um, the Excel spreadsheet, <coughs> which is provided to you, which you should have downloaded already. And uh, and a product review form which associates to the spreadsheet. Uh, so to do some analysis, which is over here, they're, they're saying that the customer uh, they what they what they don't want is uh, over accumulated stock, and they're thinking of deleting like two two products from their range, right? So they're already giving you some kind of um, idea of what should be analysed uh, in a way, uh, you, but you should stretch past that, right? Uh, but uh, the order order for my presentation here will be slightly different. I'm going to change it a bit because um, uh, the usual question is: is why am I doing this product product analysis and product review for? Right? Uh, so what I'll do is I'll try to explain to you what is involved in actually writing a business report, uh, especially for this subject. What are the key components and, uh, uh, <coughs> of the structure, and what are you actually uh, going to to fill in the report from doing this analysis. So we'll do the business report, what is the business report, what's the structure, what's actually required within this report in a general term. Then we'll actually do some uh, analysis of data and we'll, I'll show you how to use this product review form uh, which you should have downloaded and actually link what these sections within this, this uh, analysis table um, or actually imply within a in a business report by using the spreadsheet data which is supplied to us. But first of all, what we're going to do is we're going to actually clean this sort of stuff up afterwards. Uh, we don't want this yellow colour to burn the retinas off your eyes. Um, so uh, we'll do a bit of clean up before we actually get into the um, to the exercise for the analysis. Right? But the first port, point of call is activity not two, but on uh, uh, activity two here. But what we're going to do is I'm going to explain to you what is a business report, what's the structure and so forth that you expect to have for your business um, business assignment. The last part will actually be formatting a business report so there's a uh, document which you should have already downloaded, the unformatted one, and we'll actually go through and actually format to the requirements that you should expect within the business, business report assignment. Right? Uh, not to mention, though, in the, you have to read the business assignment specs uh, because there will be additional information in there that you have to cover. 